News caught up with some fans after that South Carolina game at the well today. Our Scarlett Liz Jack was at the well with more on how they're reacting. Not the right one. A week of SEC women's basketball concluded with the matchup between the South Carolina Gamecocks and the LSU Tigers Sunday evening. Go Cox! Many USC fans gathered to cheer on their team. So I'm a huge Gamecocks fan and the women are phenomenal to watch. There's only Carolina. one team in America, the Carolina Gamecocks. Team supporters traveled in from all over the country, including those who represent the same university. They play very well with each other. They have an undefeated record, um, so I'm, I'm guaranteed that they'll win. That confidence continued onto the court for the women who beat LSU for the conference title Sunday evening. Camaraderie and teamwork. It, there, is, there is no I in team, and they play like a team. It's not like about me, 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 and, and that's a joy to watch. Just fun basketball. My favorite part probably had to be all of it. <laughs> I mean, I love the Carolina Gamecocks, and all of them are so amazing. I mean, like, they, they all work together. I play basketball, my team does not do that. <laughs> fans tell us the arena was a sea of garnets and black. And Gamecock fans, they were here in masses today, and. We couldn't be prouder than to be a Carolina Gamecock. The energy was high, especially from Carolina fans through the whole game. It was great for women's basketball. The atmosphere was insane. I'm just, I'm happy I got to be a part of it. I've seen a lot of people from South Carolina, Columbia, coming out support and wearing Gamecock gear, and uh, I think it's very great. Now that the SEC championship is over, fans say they have high hopes for the Gamecocks as they now prepare to play in the NCAA tournament. Well, without question, I'm going to root for them as one of the teams I hope to get to the Final Four. Our goal is to be the national champions, a absolutely. I think we can do it, but you know, the balls have to fall the right way. You gotta have a little luck along the way. And of course, the seedings really affect the outcomes. In Greenville, Scarlett Jack, 7 News.